How many times do you have to lock your car? This is why. You just unlocked the door, got into the car, started it, got out, locked it again. Now you're about to go. Like, I'm trying to record a video. It doesn't matter what you do to your face. As long as you got some lashes and you don't dress like Giselle from Real Housewives of Potomac, then you are good, honey. But you can't dress. I'm not even gonna do it like that. She probably watches the video and be like, who is this bitch? Mind your business. beginning of the pandemic and don't judge this this is a hot mess the funny story behind this but i'm not gonna tell y'all until i'm a little bit more comfortable <laughs> telling you guys i mean it's not bad but like it's i think it's funny it has to do with me being pregnant and my husband so so yeah i feel like i want to start doing more not beauty me like trying out me trying out new makeup because the beginning of the pandemic I was trying out and practicing eyeshadow. And you guys, it was actually going very well. Some days I had like bomb, bomb eyeshadow looks. And I mean, they were pretty basic, but that's what the thing with me, I don't really like eyeshadow. So that's why I was like, you know what? There's no point. Like there's no point for me to learn how to put this eyeshadow on my face. As time went on, I was like, you know what? I want to learn because I ain't got nothing to do. We locked in the house. We on, we're on lockdown, so why not? I thought it was the perfect time to do so, so I was like, you know what? This is y'all, we're gonna do an eyeshadow look today, but I feel like today's not a good day. I might be late. I'm not a makeup guru, but I feel like I can do, I feel like I can do my makeup pretty well. When I have to film, I'm just like, you know what? I just don't have the best of luck. I look like a clown. This queen usually does her makeup at night, and at first I was like, girl, hell no. But I get it now. I get it. Her sanity and everybody's not bothering her at that time, so I'm like, I don't miss this. Because I just took a nap, and now if I wasn't going nowhere, I'd probably be like, I'm probably going to do this on a regular day, because this is fun. Imagine if I had some wine with me right now. What I'm learning how to do is, um, Lip liner, I feel like I don't know how to put lip liner on well. And it's just pretty confusing sometimes, you know? I don't know how to put it on and I don't know why. I don't know how to put it on. I follow the instructions, I do what I'm supposed to do. Maybe my lips are formed weird, I don't know. Just can't get my lip liner to look like the girls on YouTube. <laughs> It's not, it don't work out. It don't work out the way I need it to. And it's kind of annoying because I need to learn how to beat my face the way my homegirl did it for my birthday. She's inspiration to us all. Braided my hair back into like little um, braid outs. And I just hope that it comes out right because I just, I didn't do it how I normally would as if like I was doing a tutorial. I just kind of like braided it because I wanted some kind of curl. And I did it last night around 10, so I hope for the best. I mean, I put barely any water in it, but I'm like, it's okay. I just want it to look good for the night. I feel like it's important to create your own happiness. To create your own happiness. <laughs> to create your own happiness. Not saying that I'm not happy without these things, but it's important to do it. You can't depend on somebody else for fun. Like, you know, for example, like when it's like, I don't know, some holiday and people wanna barbecue, everybody be talking about something. Who gonna barbecue? You barbecue. Why? Because you need to create the fun. You know, by who you want, based off vibes, you don't gotta, you don't, you don't have to worry about being around people you don't like. 
I leave a bitch mad with a stuck face. Who the fuck y'all hoes playing with what? anyway? I'm just gonna start having events for the hell of it because I like to have fun. And I like good vibes. I don't like weird vibes. If you're a weirdo, please don't come. I'm trying to notice that there's a lot of weird people and I'm gradually fading those people out. But see, the camera makes it look like I'm too light skinned. It got me looking like, girl, you're dark skin, but you want to be light skin vibes, and that's not the case. When I'm looking at myself in the mirror, I look like chocolate, melanin, baddie. That's what it's giving me. We go keep going because we're not quitters. We don't quit. We keep moving. We do us. What am I saying? Usually when I'm doing my makeup, I like to follow different, like a different. Um, YouTuber or you know just try different method but when I'm recording I feel like I don't I'm just doing whatever I'm literally just doing whatever I think that's next and it's kind of annoying because and it might not come out right because I'm talking and I'm not a makeup artist and I don't know how to go I'm so sorry y'all I mean these individuals do it but I'm gonna try I forgot to put on my contacts. Oh, word. I better go do that now because I'm not be looking crazy in the middle of the night. I was somewhere in my car. I used to like to bake, but now I just don't. I just kind of like press it into my skin. I got this from this one YouTuber name. I believe her name is Jocelyn. Jocelyn Part Parti. I forgot. But I got this idea from her. And Sometimes I use it, sometimes I don't. And I believe later on that other YouTubers start to do this as well, but I could be wrong, I don't know. But I got it from her first. Yeah, I'm looking kind of crusty, but what is, there's a lot going on. Is something biting me on sleep? I hate when people say it's a no for me, it's, it's the eyes for me, it's the lies, it's the brows for me, it's the it's the vibe for me, it's this for me. Like, it's a no, it's not annoying to you. Maybe I'm just a mean bitch, but like I don't like that. It is so irritating. What are you saying? Why are you saying that? I don't know where it came from, but it's really annoying. It actually looks really good, but you can't tell because I'm on my camera phone and for some reason. I feel like phones, or at least all the phones I've had, it doesn't show how good this face looks. But I promise, maybe because of the setting. Should I try and fix it? Let me try. Because I don't need to look like a light skin. I'm not light skin. I'm, I'm chocolate. I done made the thing worse. I can't even see what I'm doing. Let me just put it back. I'm not doing a lot today. I said this every time I do my makeup. But I'm not doing a lot today because I am just, I'm gonna be in the dark anyway. As long as my lashes look good and my lips are popping, I'm good. I wanna learn how to do a lot of things. Like how do I do a wing liner? How do I put on eyeshadow? How, like what other products do I need to use? I need it to be extra like fire. What do I need to do? So, do y'all see what I just, so, so, so. This is not it, ma'am. Do you guys think I should do a Christmas party or a New Year's? Can't kill myself without this damn party, so I gotta pick one. So I'm trying to see which one I'm gonna do. And I need some assistance. I do this makeup, it's about to be a mess again because I'm about to change your hair. I'm about to brush your hair. Like, it's a lot going on. And I don't need to do that. I need to come up with a systematically perfect solution. I think all women have this problem though. And men be like, y'all just don't know what, y'all need to mind your business because it takes a lot to be a bad bitch. Who are you? Who are we? We are that bitch. Ladies, if you can't fall in line with all that, he's the wrong dude. Okay. If a man does not understand that it takes a bad bitch a long time to get dressed, Go find another dude. I promise you, there's plenty out there. Come on, Black Kings. I said what I said. This is how I did my hair. <laughs> Not because of the most, it's because of me. 
Let me oil my scalp. I did my hair and then I missed one. I have a sp sponge roller in it. Guys, it's hard being a woman out here. Ooh, the wrong pieces. Okay, no, that's right. Y'all see my voice sounds better? When I first came on here, I sound like a dude, huh? Probably still sound like one, but not as bad. I have a big mirror that usually sits in front of me when I do my makeup, but I had to move it. Well, my husband moved it to the closet so I could record because I was like, my ring light would not go to like right here. My old one, before it broke, it usually went all the way down to where it can sit on the table. But this new one, it's a lot fancier and it only stops right here on the table and y'all can't see me when I'm up here doing my makeup. That's not good. Me being right here is not gonna work. You're not really that fine until you put lashes on, that's all I'm saying. I remember when I was getting into makeup and I used to just say, I'm only gonna do lashes for special events. And then it became a lazy thing to where I was like, you know what, I don't feel like putting it on, I'm not going to a wedding. And I'm like, these girls are slaying. I did the same beat, but why does their beat look better than mine? It's the lashes. So then I was like, you know what, let me learn how to put some lashes on. It was a struggle. I started off with a blue pack of lashes. When I tell you guys, I've upgraded to the 3D lash. Guys, this was like, I think 20, 14, 2015, I was like, you know what? I need to change my life. I need to, I need to be the ultimate baddie. I'm playing games with myself. I don't know how to put on lashes. Learn. You don't know how to put on lashes? Learn. Right, next time I'm going to do a before and after so y'all can see what I'm saying. Hell, you don't. Hell, I don't need to do a before and after. Rewind the video and look at me before and after. I usually have a hard time with getting it close to the lash line so when i do have that problem i just take this black eyeliner and just put it underneath i'm not saying it works i just do it and i'm probably not going to notice that i need to fix my lash until after i've recorded this video and trust me i would have fixed it so if it look a mess right now and i'm thinking i'm slaying i can't tell i was going to do this on tiktok to put your blush up here so i said okay maybe i should have she wasn't black so just pray that these crazy people are not where I'm gonna be at because of this election stuff. Y'all better not F me tonight because y'all need to not act crazy around me. Don't drive crazy around me. Don't talk no crazy shit. I'm minding my business, you mind your business. Did you get it? Did I tell you? Didn't I tell you? Don't start none, won't be none, okay? I don't need these crazy people to come out tonight and bother me because Nikita's gonna come out. And when Nikita comes out, then there's a problem. And Nikita does not want to be out in public today. Y'all probably like, who is Nikita? I'm gonna reference Nikita a lot, but eventually tell you guys who Nikita is. But based off the name, I'm pretty sure you have an idea of who Nikita is. It doesn't matter what you do to your face. As long as you got some lashes and you don't dress like Giselle from Real Housewives of Potomac. But I just hope Giselle's fashion sense don't rub off on Monique. Thank God Giselle is a good looking woman because God damn, she can't dress at all. I'm ashamed to be seen with her sometime to be honest. I don't know what she gonna wear. I gotta hear they talking about Giselle's clothes. You have an exception or a time now. Then you are good, honey. But you can't dress. I'm not even gonna do it like that. She probably watches me and be like, who is this bitch? <laughs> Mind your bitch, though.
know I'm gonna tie it, but I'm gonna just put my clothes on and they so fat. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. I'm just wearing a, this is like a sweater, sweater dress, sweater dress thingy. So yeah, and I just put my hair up like this and the curls came out cute. It's not too much, it's very simple. I'm probably gonna be back in the next three hours, so it is what it is. I like this beat, not too much, very simple, bad bitch still. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.